Hey everybody, welcome back to another video here on the Washington Football Maniacs channel. If you're new here, please consider subscribing to this channel. When you do, make sure you hit that notification bell so you'll never miss another video release on the Washington Football Maniacs YouTube channel. So now we're talking about quarterbacks for next year. Who is going to be the quarterback for the Washington football team? Here's what I do know. We're not going to invite Carson Wentz back. I think if we invited Carson Wentz back to be the quarterback of this team, then there is something mildly wrong with Ron Rivera. You just, you can't. You can't. After the performance he had against the Browns, you can't. And if he plays against the Cowboys, I don't know why you would play him. I think you would play Sam Howell, but because you got to know what you have in Sam Howell. And you know what? He has watched the team the entire season. I think at this point you do give him a chance. Give him an opportunity. Now, yes, it's going to be tough because you're playing against the team that has a very strong opportunity to still take the NFC East. And they could possibly even still get the number one seed in the NFC. I'm talking about the Dallas Cowboys. So it's not that this would be an easy game for Sam Howell to, to make his debut. But I think you play him. Kind of have to evaluate, okay, what, what do we have in Sam Howell? You know, is he somebody that we think that he's going to be further developed next year? He's going to actually start pushing for the starting position? Because here's the thing. If he's not ready to start next year, you've got to have somebody in there. You can't roll with Taylor Heineke, and you, for sure you can't have Carson Wentz in there. I mean, that's just that's just a full-blown fact. You know, honestly, for me, I would want to just roll with Sam Howell and say, you know what, new ownership. If it was a new coach, I would say, you, you know, let's roll with Sam Howell. Although a new coach usually wants his own quarterback, you're looking for just little nuances here and there. Is there going to be anybody there at, was it number 15, I think, is where we're probably going to wind up drafting at? You're going to have to find another quarterback. If it's Ron Rivera who's still coaching, and it's likely he will be, you're year four. You've got to hit a home run. You can't roll with Taylor Heineke again. You can't roll with Carson Wentz. So your only option is Sam Howell and somebody in free agency. Right now, everybody's talking about Derek Carr. I don't know if Derek Carr is going to be the guy who's going to lead you to the promised land or not. I wanted him back maybe a couple of years ago when we picked up Fitz. And we didn't get Carr. Carr stayed with Oakland or stayed with Las Vegas. I think they were still in Oakland at that point. You may have Tom Brady. I, I know, it sounds stupid. It, it sounds stupid coming out of my mouth too, but you may have Tom Brady available for at least one year. Now, how great would that be for someone like Sam Howell to be able to take a back seat to the GOAT and to learn from Tom Brady for a year and to watch Tom Brady play and hopefully when Sam Howell enters his third year you know because Tom Brady's likely to play one year and be done so to be able to play behind Tom Brady for a year and then his third year he should be ready now is that likely to happen who knows like I said new ownership you're not playing for Dan Steiner anymore so this is something completely new and who, who else? I mean, could maybe Lamar Jackson. Maybe he's available. If Lamar Jackson can be lured away from Baltimore, maybe you bring him in. Let's really spend the offseason looking to upgrade that offensive line because that's where it's really going to be important. That's where it's going to really be a game changer. Let me know in the comments below sorry I am still obviously sick so I'm trying to get through these videos the best I can uh, but let me know in the comments what you 
you think about all this. Um, if you like this video, please give it a like, um, share it with your friends. That being said, hopefully I'll see you in the next one. Hey, you stayed until the very end. Thank you so much. Watch another one right now.